Do you see a screen on the back? Yeah. Do you see me? Yeah. Am I in? Do I have a nice picture behind me? Yeah, there's a bunch of cars behind you. All right, fucking awesome. Do you see the AMG behind me? Yeah. All right, Titty City. What? Suck a dick. Um, <laughs> <laughs> all right, today I want to talk about um, a shop cam that we have here at DFR. It's, uh, you know, respectively named the Hellraiser, mainly because the shop's name is Diablo from the Racing. And, you know, Diablo's in the Diablo from the Racing part. Um, this cam is is a very good cam, very great power maker cam. Um, we tested it in a couple different cars. Uh, one of the cars that you'll see in the video here is a 2001 NHRA Edition Trans Am. Um, it's uh, a fully forged engine, stock cubic inches, uh, fast 92 intake, 243 unforded heads, and uh, Ford 9 inch with 410 gears and an LS7 clutch going through a six speed transmission. The car put down 428 rear wheel horsepower, 384 foot pounds of torque. Cam only and no head work done, no none of that stuff, just cam only. Um, I think that says it, you know, you know, enough of what that cam is capable of doing. I would like to tell you people what the specs are of this cam, but I can tell you that the cam is in the 230s duration and it is above 600 lift on the intake and the exhaust and it either features a 113 LSA or a 112 LSA or even a 111 LSA if that's something you'd be interested in. <clears throat> Um, this particular cam that made 428 horsepower was featured on a 113 plus 4 degrees ground into it. Um, this is on an asymmetrical lobe design, so uh, that's what we like to use here at DFR. Uh, the nice thing about the asymmetrical lobe design on the cams that we use, whether it be the Hellraiser cam or any of the other cams that we use, is the fact that the opening rate of the cam is fast and the closing rate closing valve what that means is there's less wear and tear on the springs on the valves um, you know on all the valve train components in, in, in general there's less wear and tear um, so it's a much op much faster opening rate much slower closing rate that's what asymmetrical means uh, one side of the lobe is curved the other side is a little less curved than the than the other side is um, this customer of mine was the first customer to try out this cam and have this cam in his car. Um, I can guarantee you with certain mods, this cam and a good flowing intake manifold, whether it be a uh, Fast 90 or a Fast 92 intake on an LS car, um, this cam is guaranteed to make you through a six speed M6 car, 400 plus horsepower to the wheels. Um, no bullshit and lie there at all. Um, here's another picture of another customer that has this uh, cam. And uh, he was at a car show a couple years back and actually uh, not blew his tires out, but um, he caught them on fire. So here's a picture of that. His name's Joe. He's, a, he's another good customer of mine. We uh, put that cam in his car as well, and we also tuned the car as well. That's a 98 car with uh, LS1 intake, stock 806 heads, that, uh, you know, Hellraiser cam and uh, mainly bolt-ons, nothing else. Here's an idle video of the cam as well. If This is uh, the idle video on this car is stock, non-tuned. We literally put the cam in, we uh, fired it up with stock injectors, and it idled fine on a stock 2001 tune. Um, no tuning was done to this car at all. Uh, I'm trying to think more stuff to say about this fucking cam. It's great. Put it in your fucking car. It's great. Put it in your fucking car. If you want this cam, be sure to contact me. 
on uh, either YouTube here, you can contact me on YouTube, you can contact me on Instagram at Diablo Formula Racing, or you can contact me on Facebook as well as at Diablo Formula Racing. I've been working today, as you can see, my hands are dirty. We have an AMG in the shop, and um, we have another Camaro back there in the shop as well, which we're messing around with as well. So um, tomorrow, I think we we have a uh, car being come, you know, coming in here, a car coming in here for a tune, um, some MS3 uh, PRC head cam tower. So um, we're gonna be messing with that tomorrow morning. But uh, like I said, the main main point of this video was I wanted to introduce everybody to the Hellraiser cam and let everybody understand that you know this cam does make a really good power um, the cam is from Lunati um, we do the installs here we do the tuning here and all that stuff we do we know what this cam makes on a 98 to 02 LS we know what this cam kind of makes on uh, LS2 and the LS3 engines we are currently looking to sponsor a Camaro ZL1 2012 and up for this cam is what we're looking to do right now. We're trying to, we're looking for a, a 2012 and up ZL1, um, preferably a six speed, we'll do an automatic if necessary, but we are looking for a six speed just so we can get the most out of this out of this cam. Um, and currently what we're looking to do is we're looking to sponsor a 2012 and up ZL1 with this cam um, and do it a cam only on stock boost with maybe with a flapper mod and um, a coder intake and, and uh, full bolt ons like headers, exhaust, stuff of that nature. And we really wanna see what this cam can make with a ZL1 under boost. Um, I think the numbers would be very, very interesting and it'd be cool to you know see what this cam can actually do. So if you know anybody or if um, you have a ZL1 yourself, please be, feel, feel free to contact us in you know, either Instagram or Facebook. We're on here at uh, YouTube as well. <clears throat> um, don't forget to follow us. Uh, obviously, it's Diablo Formula Racing on YouTube. It's Diablo Formula Racing on Instagram. And it's Diablo Formula Racing on Facebook as well. So subscribe, like, follow, and uh, just look out for our next video. Deuces.